Okay, uh, let's get this out of the way right now. The reason why I'm holding the phone up uh, this close to my face while I uh, record this is because uh, for some reason my laptop mic stopped working. So now I have to use my phone uh, as a mic. So, yeah. At least I'm able to do that because otherwise if I had no mic at all, then I'd be completely screwed. So, thankfully I'm able to do this uh, in the meantime. So yeah, if you're wondering why I sound different, this is the reason why. So, uh, I've actually come back to, to streaming for a, a little while now, and uh, but uh, you're probably wondering, you know, where I've been for the last two months uh, before I, I started streaming again. Uh, basically, um, for the majority of July, um, I had to stay with my brother, um, who who lives in another state, and um, you know. During that time, you know, my, I, I probably mentioned this before, but um, my, my uh, laptop screen uh, broke um, back in 2019, like towards the very end of the year. So I've been needing to use a monitor um, to be able to see what's, what, what I'm doing, you know, whenever I use my PC and whatnot. You know, so that's why, I, you know, I've been sitting in this chair instead of what my old setup used to be uh, back when I, in my earlier days of streaming. You know, so, you know, he only has uh, one monitor that, that he could use at his house. So, you know, it was either he, he got to use his PC or, or you know, I, I was using on mine and, you know, it was his house, you know, and, and everything like that. So it's not like, you know. I could be the one to dictate, you know, who gets to spend how much time where and whatnot. So, you know, I basically need to either, you know, do what I wanted to do early, you know, in the day or, or you know, let him do what he wanted to do first. And um, then then it would be my turn to use the my laptop and, and his monitor and whatnot. In hindsight, I probably could have still made YouTube content at least while I was staying over there. Because um, I'm pretty sure I probably could have used one of his cameras that he uses to play VR games as a, a webcam. Or I could have just used my own webcam. And, you know, now that I know that... Now that I know how to use a, a phone as a microphone, I, I could have done this as well. So, you know... While I probably couldn't have streamed while I was staying over at his house, I, I could have at least, you know, made videos in the meantime. But, you know, hindsight is twenty twenty and all that. So, about what my plans are going forward. Um, I know today is uh, the day where people are taking a day off of Twitch um, to protest, um, you know. Because there's been hate raids going on lately. And In fact, I, I've got a stream open on right now and i'm actually seeing a hate raid happen live on that channel and um yeah people have been going into uh streams uh uh of you know black people and, and women and, and trans people and stuff like that and basically using bots to spam hateful messages at these streamers um while they're live and apparently it's gotten so bad now where um they're they're doing this um even to channels that aren't live and um, then screenshotting the chats and, and reporting them to Twitch saying, hey, uh, this person's not moderating their chat, you know, and getting them banned that way. <clears throat> so, you know, now rather or not um, the whole offline hate rate thing is actually happening because I haven't seen that happen yet. Um, regardless of whether or not it's happening, the fact that it is totally believable that, that Twitch would actually ban people um, for um, offline hate raids, um, for the reason of not moderating their chat. <laughs> the fact that that is totally believable is a reflection of what people think of Twitch as well as, uh, their incompetence and, um, their lack of action on the hate raids that we know for a fact are going on for sure, um, is definitely not a good look on Twitch as well. So that's why people are, um, taking the day off um, from streaming on Twitch, and uh, I won't be streaming today on Twitch as well. Um, but, um, you know, it's just a one-day protest. It's not really going to do anything. Uh, what really needs to happen is um, people need to stay off the platform 
until Twitch actually does something uh, about these hate raids and whatnot. You know, you can't change things just by not streaming for a day. You, you have to keep it up until your demands are met. You know what I mean? Uh, the civil rights movement didn't achieve uh, what they wanted to just by protesting for one day. They, they kept on protesting until the Civil Rights Act was passed. So, you know, I, I, as much as I support, you know, the movement against hate raids and as much as I want chain, uh, Twitch to, ch to change how, how they do things and, and to actually do something to fight against hate raids, um, you know, just a one-day protest isn't going to do anything. And especially if it's not the bigger streamers on the platform who, who are not participating in it, you know? And and the worst part of all of this is that um so there's this thing that Twitch does every year um, called September, uh, which um is when uh, during the entire month of September uh, of September you um uh, basically uh, subscribing to a Twitch channel is, is cheaper. Usually it's five dollars, but um I, I think originally it was half off, but but now it's just a dollar cheaper. So. Yeah, you save a dollar. What, what a big, <laughs> what a big savings there, you know? So, excuse me. So, yeah, um, because, you know, today is the day where everybody's taking a day off Twitch. They, they've actually postponed uh, the start of September until tomorrow. So, so yeah, um, it's basically like another acknowledgement of, um, you know, what, what's been going on here and the response to it, but... <sighs> Yeah, it, it, it's the way Twitch has been handling it is just a mess. Like, like other than saying, you know, like one tweet where, where they said that they're working on fixing the problem, but they can't discuss, you know, what specifically they're doing publicly or whatever. You know, you got to show us something, you know, you got to you got to give us more than that. You got to at least show us that you, you're, you're doing something about it, even, you know. Yeah. So, yeah. Now, um, <clears throat> something else that, that does need to be acknowledged um, to go along uh, with this. Um, there are some people who are inevitably um, going to have to stream today uh, because they, they're not, you know, among the big streamers who can afford to not stream for a while actually and be okay you know some people are going to have to stream no matter what um so you know for for those people you know th there are understandable circumstances um for why um somebody might stream uh, on a day where where everybody's agreed to not stream uh, so don't get mad at those people. Don't get mad at them for, you know, um, streaming or participating in Twitch or whatever like that. Um, and as much as I hate to have to um, mention this, um, immediately after talking about um, why people are protesting uh, on Twitch to begin with, um, you know, I, I also have to acknowledge that... Um, I am trying to make a living off of Twitch as well, and um, I desperately need uh, a new PC uh, b because, as as I've already mentioned in other previous update videos before, the one that I'm currently using is um, not doing very well, and I'm barely able to keep it together. And uh, problems with it, like it freezing on me all of a sudden, or not booting up when I try to turn it on, you know, those problems are becoming more frequent and they're going to get worse over time. So I'm really trying to do everything I can to uh, get a new PC as quickly as possible. So um, any support that you can throw my way, you know, whether it be on Twitch or PayPal would, would be greatly appreciated. Obviously, you don't have to if you're not able to. I know things are going bad with, with the economy right now because of the, the pandemic. Um, and um, my audience is small, which means that not very many people are even going to see this um, in the first place. But, you know, any help that you can throw my way, um, because, you know, like I said, you know, subs are going to be cheaper um, on Twitch during September. So if you can sub to my channel uh, on Twitch, um, that would help me out. 
and also uh, giving me bits which I know are a ripoff because they cost more than uh, what they're worth. But, um, you know, and, and here's another thing too, because Twitch, you used to be able to um, watch ads uh, for bits uh, on Twitch. You know, you, you watch an ad and then they give you some bits and, and you can go and, and, and cheer bits in, in another person's channel. And that would be a way that you could uh, support them through a donation uh, without having to spend any money. Now they've gotten rid of that and, and replaced it with a system where instead um, a streamer will run a specific type of ad and um, you like participate in a poll or, or something and, and the streamer gets bits uh, based on how many people voted in that poll. So yeah, easily a, a way worse system than, than what they had before. So, you know, you basically, if, if you don't want to, you know, buy bits, you have to be a streamer in, in order to get bits now. So yeah, um, subs and bits on Twitch um, are, are the best way to support me at the moment or otherwise you can just uh, donate to me on PayPal, but, but please don't, don't use PayPal to donate only $1 to me because, um, PayPal recently changed the, the rates at, at which, um, you know, they basically changed how much they take, um, from, uh, uh, you know, when you, when you pay someone directly on, on PayPal and whatnot. So, you know, if you, if you were to give me a, a dollar on PayPal, I would actually receive, uh, less than that, like less than half <laughs> of a dollar. So yeah, uh, PayPal donations are, are, are fine still. Just, you know, keep that in mind. And, and like I said, don't donate just $1. <laughs> um, but yeah, and, and, and I'm not saying, you know, I, I need money for a new PC, you know, just, you know, for my own personal benefit, because um, if I were to get a, a PC that could um, run, you know, games that have been released in, you know, within the last five or six years, uh, then I would be able to um, not not just play more games, but also stream more games as well. You know, like like I could stream modern stuff, like I don't know the Resident Evil remakes or, or the or The Witcher Three or something like that. You know, so it would also be good for for you guys as well, because I would be able to, um, you know stream more games and therefore, you know, provide you games with a wider variety of content and whatnot. So, you know, I, I'm not trying to do it, you know, just for my own benefit. You guys would be uh, benefiting too, okay? So, um, with all that said, um, oh yeah, one last thing that, that I, I want to mention here. Um, <laughs> I, I'm very sorry for, for not being consistent with uh, doing Marvel Mondays or Marvel Saturdays, rather. Um, what I'm going to do once I get done recording this uh, update video is um, I'm going to record um, my thoughts and reactions to the Eternals trailer and the Spider-Man No Way Home trailer. And then um, I'm going to go watch the, the new uh, What If episode because that also comes out today. So uh, yeah, as soon as I get done recording this, I'm going to re record my, my trailer thoughts and reactions, watch the new What If episode, and upload everything. So... Yeah, because um, I figure it's better for me to, uh, you know, since I, I, I've fallen so behind on, on keeping up with, with, with the current events, you know, with, with new MCU content and whatnot, it's better for me to just, you know, uh, post my uh, trailer reactions on, on, on YouTube and then Saturday uh, we'll discuss, you know, everything that's been going on with the What If series up, up till now. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to go and, and do all that stuff right now and um hopefully i'll see you guys saturday so uh, thanks for watching and uh yeah take care everybody hope you have a nice day